oh yeah, in LA, in LA, in LA, and Nathan's over there, chilling on the bed, say hey babe. Hey. Hey. So, if you are wondering why I'm in LA, okay, first of all, drum roll please. I am in LA because I am going to the Mulan premiere. What? Oh my God, I have been dying literally to tell you guys. It was just one of those things where I was like, I couldn't believe it because it's so good. I'm just like, this can't be true, but it's true. I'm here, I cannot believe it. Wow, what the hell? Thank you to Disney, it really means so much to me that you reached out to my management and was like, hey, wanna bring things to LA for the premiere of Mulan. I literally freaked out and what's so crazy is that the day I got the news, I had a really shit day. <laughs> Sorry for my language, but you know, I just gotta keep it real on here. But yeah, I just couldn't believe it. And I was just so, I don't know. It just literally made me so happy. Like, I don't even know if happy is even a word. Ecstatic, overwhelmed. I don't know. I just couldn't believe it because growing up, Mulan was like the only Asian female character that I could literally look up to. But yeah, I am in LA right now. We're gonna go get ready. I'm gonna go and eat some Din Tai Fun because we are so hungry and I am feeling crazy because of the jet lag. So how you guys been? Oh my God, it feels like I haven't done a vlog in such a long time. The last vlog I did was in Switzerland. And ever since then, I've just been like creating makeup content for you guys on my YouTube. So yeah, it just feels so good to like vlog. Oh my God, my dress, my dress for the moon on premiere i got a story to tell you all so basically what happened was that i was searching so i got the news of going to the Mulan premiere like two months ago and I was thinking for a really long time okay what type of dress do I want to go for and then there's this designer called Donna Matoshi shout out to Donna Matoshi thank you so much for letting me wear one of your dresses her dresses are insanely gorgeous and it's very like luxe it's very, it's very like princess dresses type of gown type of wear so I was like okay this is my first time going to a real premiere and this is the global one as well so I was like I need to like kind of like look like I fit in if you know what I mean I can't be wearing pretty little thing and misguided as much as I love those two brands I know I have to wear something that's you know different so I reached out got my dress it is fitted to my size which is so amazing by the way but yeah I'm getting my makeup done as well by Pout Academy Pout Academy is owned by Lipstick Nick and I'm getting my makeup done by a woman called Elena and yeah I cannot wait to like film getting my makeup done by her because her makeup looks so incredible I just wanted to share the process with you guys because this is something that I want to remember like this is something I want to look back next year and be like wow this time last year I was also, oh my god guys, I'm on my period. Look how much I've been breaking out. Oh, it's so annoying. Look at all these little pimples and they won't go away. I've been doing like a face mask every other day and it just won't go. And I'm so annoyed. So guys, we are ready. I am showered. My hair is so soft. Oh my god, I like proper like wash my hair, like shampooed it like three times to make sure that all of that airplane dirt is like off my body. Uh, we're on our way to Din Tai Fung. I am so excited because I am so hungry. I am like dying for some uh, green beans and a beef stew and egg fried rice. Oh yeah, and Xiaolong Bao. Oh my God, I can't wait to stuff my face with Chinese food. Here it is, guys. Oh my God, it's the Tai Oh my God. And that's me as a dumpling. <laughs> Do you want sweet sour pork baby ribs? It's cold. And I got a bubble tea with pudding as well because I'm over boba. It's all about pudding these days. Oh yeah, and also guys, these cucumbers tasted so good. This is what happens when you don't eat for like 12 hours. Everything just tastes amazing. God, here's the dumplings. This is the chicken dumplings. Not the traditional show long bao, but that is coming. But these chicken dumplings, oh my God. We have 20 dumplings to eat, guys. This guy better finish it all. But yeah, so delicious. Woo! The infamous Shao Long Bao is finally here. I'm so happy. I am doing so well, guys. I finished my beef soup, finished all my noodles, trying to finish my green beans, but the more I eat it, it's not going away. I don't know why. Babe, you need to eat the green beans. No green beans. Oh, you need to eat it. You need to finish it. Anyway, Shao Long Bao, here I come. Good morning. So it is the next 
next day is the day of the premiere! Oh my god! This is literally how I look every morning, guys. I am not joking. Hi, I am so attractive. <laughs> I literally woke up an hour ago and I was just chilling in my bed. I was just doing some emails. I was doing, you know, adult things. And then I decided to go on TikTok because I want to do some TikToks while I'm at the Mulan premiere. Like, I don't know if that's, like, even allowed, but it's the modern day society. Like, if you don't do a TikTok while you're out and about, what are you doing with your life? So I'm currently on the Plastic Boys Instagram. No, TikTok. Oh, my God, not Instagram. Forget Instagram, guys. Um, I'm on the Plastic Boys TikTok trying to learn this dance. And I am so rubbish. I can't do it. How does Gary do it? Gary, how do you do it? Oh, my God. I'm going to get some breakfast. I'm going to film some TikToks. And I'm going to get transformed for the premiere. Let's try it. Come on, Gary. <laughs> Okay guys, I have made it. I'm getting my makeup done at Pout. Oh yeah, by Lipstick Nick. I am so happy to be here right now. And inside, it looks so like beautiful. Look at that. Oh my god. So cute. And the wall. Oh my god guys, the aesthetics in here is insane. Look at all of this coolness. Look at this art. Oh my god. So crazy. So excited to get my makeup done, guys. Oh, look, guys. The makeup artist is sitting at the table. Look at this eyeshadow palette. Oh my god. Do you know what? I actually don't even have this eyeshadow palette, but I'm going to go ahead and buy it with my Morphe code. Yes. Use code LING. Save some money. <laughs> P. Louise here as well. Oh yeah. Got some glam glow. Love a bit of glam glow. Got some touch. This is like my favorite, favorite um, primer. Oh my god, look at the smoky eye, I love it! So I'm literally teaching, and I can't get the vlog babes! I'm literally teaching her how to use TikTok. I don't TikTok. have a TikTok, she so she's, TikTok, she's, she's making me forced her to get a TikTok, because that's what it is nowadays. Okay, I'm put some gems on. So, I was thinking maybe, like, the black. Yeah. yeah. And then, I don't know how I would look from this up. I, I think I'll look nice and clean. I'm so shit with my hair. <laughs> <laughs> it's actually a joke. <laughs> I don't brush my hair right. <laughs> 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 oh, yeah, no, yeah, yeah, yeah. This is my hair short. I'm like, do I need to brush it? No. Yeah. I do wash it though. That's good. That's the most important thing. I did bring some hair extensions. Oh. I bought a fake pony hair extension. Okay. So. This is how I take out my hair extensions. <laughs> I just shove it in the bag. Here I go. Choose <laughs> a bit of oil. Okay, let's just break through. <laughs> I definitely want a little side something. Yeah. Just a little neck cover too much of the dress. No, because the back of the dress I don't care. It's don't the care. front. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> for hooking me up with this beautiful corset dress. I'm gonna get Nathan to do like a full on, you know, head to toe shot of this dress. Honestly, I am so in love with it. I've never worn anything like this in my whole entire life. And guys, I really wanted to treat myself because it's my first time getting to a premiere. So I definitely wanted to go the extra mile and get like a custom, not custom make, because this dress is like easily available on Donna Matoshi's website. Like you can literally buy it. But um, as in like it's customized to my size. So I've never had a dress that literally fits 
from bust to waist to hips like yeah it's so cool and i love it and i love the embroidery on the side as well it's so sick i love it yes my camera is running out of battery what is wrong with actually no it's not even me it's nathan nathan bought the wrong canon charger Anyway, um, I'm not allowed to bring my vlogging camera to the premiere, so what I'm going to do is that I'm actually going to vlog on my phone. So I hope you guys don't mind if I do that. And I will see you later. Guys, we just finished the movie. How did you find it, babe? Yeah, it's very good. It was so good. When I literally saw the whole entire cast on stage, I got so emotional because seeing Jet Li and Johnny Yen, I was like, I literally grew up watching you guys. It was so good, but right in front of me, I'm not sure if I'm allowed to vlog this. So basically, See, there's like a floor where we can do activities and I'm not joking guys in front of me there is a brand making a Mulan makeup collection I'm not sure if I'm allowed to like show but I'm gonna ask the people who work for this brand if I can because I am literally scared of future Ling here hello my phone ran out of battery <laughs> typical wow so the brand that's actually doing the collection for Mulan I'm not gonna say who it is because I really want it to be a surprise because I feel like that was such a huge tree and the brand that's doing it i'm so glad that this is it's this brand specifically because it's honestly a brand that i absolutely adore they are cruelty free as well so just to let you guys know and yeah I, I i i wish i could say more but honestly i can't but the mulan makeup collection will be launched the day before it goes live into cinema so make sure you guys are ready because you're gonna wet yourself because the collection looks gorgeous good morning everyone it is the next day the day after the premiere literally me and nathan we were so well i was really like like, tired is not even the word. I was just very like claustrophobic in my dress because it was so tight and so is my pony. So I was just like, babe, we just need to get back to our hotel ASAP. And then we had to like finish filming a TikTok, which I know guys, we're like such crazy content creators. <laughs> but honestly, last night was so good. The movie was so good. I mean, I'm gonna sound biased because I just love Mulan regardless because she is literally one of the idols that I looked up to when I was growing up as a, you know, Asian kid. But yeah, I really, really loved the movie. And what really made me so emotional was seeing the whole entire cast of Mulan on stage before the movie started. Like, I don't know what happened. I don't know what went over me, but just seeing like Donnie Yen and Jet Li and who is the other guy again? You should know. I know I should know, but I only know Donnie Yen and Jet Li, but there's another one where Obviously you tapped the main, me. The main character as well. Mulan, how to play Mulan. Yeah, yeah, oh, Lee, Lee, Lee. <laughs> I actually don't know her that well. I think she's more of a Chinese actress in China, if that makes any sense. But yeah, oh my god, I'm gonna like stop embarrassing myself now. But basically, the people that I grew up watching was Jet Li and Donnie Yen, most of the movies. Like, I loved it so much. And just seeing them in person. Oh literally just like melt with my heart and just made me feel so proud of like where i'm from and like obviously with what's going on in china with the coronavirus and you know we do have somewhat a negative stigma going on right now but i just hope that when this movie is like released and the whole public watches it i just hope this like you know raise the spirits up in china and yeah i just i don't know i just hope everything works out well for china because it's just so sad what's going on oh yeah and also guys as soon as the premiere was done we was trying to get an uber it literally took us like 10 minutes to get an uber so we ordered like five ubers to go to in and out so where the theater was it was on sunset boulevard and also on sunset boulevard there is an in and out and i love in and out so does nathan as well we wanted to get an uber to in and out however though we were only like what two blocks away so technically we could walk there but my feet was in so much pain literally guys my toes were literally bursting like there was so much blood on my toes i was like ah i can't walk anymore and also because my dress is like a corset i was like no 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 i can't do it anymore so um we ordered like five ubers to in and out burger but no they all cancelled on us, which was so unfair. And we were like sending them text messages saying, oh, if you could just take us to In-N-Out Burger and then we will um, change it to our hotel. But no, they all like declined it. Stop trying to pretend to be me. Wrap it up. Wrap I'm trying it up. to wrap it up, but there's just so yeah. much to talk about. Anyway, um, we managed to get to in and out We had this really nice Uber guy. And uh, yeah, we got back to the hotel and I literally just crashed out. I was just so 
tired. Anyway, I just want to say thank you to you guys for just being so supportive. Like, honestly, the messages that you guys have been sending me on Instagram is just... I'm just, I just feel very overwhelmed with love right now and I just feel so grateful and you know, if it wasn't for you guys, I wouldn't be here. And also thank you to Linda Blacker as well. Please guys, follow her, show her so much love and like all her posts because she is one of the best photographers I have personally ever worked with and her work is just insane and honestly i feel like she's gonna make it i mean she's already big already in the photography world but i feel like in the future she's gonna do some insane incredible jobs i can feel it in my heart like you know when you meet someone who's like really like talented and they work hard like you just know that they're gonna have like a really big future so yeah it would mean so much to me if you guys could show her some love and support her as well and thank you to disney as well like thank you so much for like flying me out here and honestly i had the best time and and just so sad because me and Nathan are going back home literally like in a few hours but we are gonna come back to LA for my birthday and yeah have lots of fun but honestly guys thank you so much for watching this vlog it means so much to me and I will see you in the next one. Oh yeah also one more thing thank you to Donna Matoshi your dress girl every I'm not joking. Every single person literally loved the dress that I wore. Like, even at the premiere, like, I've never received so many compliments before. I was like, wow. Wow, this feels really great. <laughs> so, yeah, guys, I will leave a link down below in the description box if you guys want to check out Donna Masoshi dresses. She also does bridal dresses. Her, herself, as a designer, she's so sweet. And, yeah. Love you guys, and I'll see you in the next one.